Our body has many enemies. It's constantly being attacked by viruses, bacteria, fungal spores, and parasites. They enter the body through injuries to the skin, food, or through the respiratory tract. Viruses use our cells to make thousands of copies of themselves. Other pathogens secrete toxins. As a result, more and more cells are infected or destroyed. But our body doesn't let itself be defeated so easily. Mast cells in the mucous membrane sound the alarm and release messenger substances. The immune system springs into action and white blood cells launch a counterattack. And we feel it. The battleground regions begin to swell. The body temperature rises to kill viruses and bacteria. Via the nasal mucous membranes, pathogens are expelled from the body. The defense cells have different special abilities. Macrophages, the white blood cells, kill invaders as well as infected and dead cells. They are the body's garbage disposal. Plasma cells produce antibodies that render pathogens harmless. Molecular markers enable the immune system to distinguish between the body's own cells and foreign bodies. The body doesn't have a suitable response for all pathogens, but giving up is not an option. The attackers are thoroughly analyzed by immune cells. In the process, the antibodies are varied until the right formula is found. Now they can be produced en masse. Sometimes the process takes days or weeks. If everything goes well, the body defeats the attackers. And not only that, once the right weapon has been found, so-called memory cells immediately recognize the pathogen the next time it appears. In this way, the immune system protects us from many diseases, often without us even realizing.